Hey guys, it's Ryzen51 here, your Angel of Light, shining another bright day on your Let's Plays. Today we are done with the cutscenes with Bowser and everything, and learning about what Groves' plan is now with Peach, and we lost Tech, sad face, and I have a special guest with me, so please sir, introduce yourself. What's up guys, this is the Mario Studio here, and this is the first episode of me joining Rise of 51's channel! Hooray! <laughs> yes, this is uh, Mario Studio's first time joining me today. Uh, actually, I want Bob are you with me here. Alright, so uh, we're... Oh! I think you said, like, Bob, this Bob Mario Studio or something. Oh. <laughs> I think, uh, surely I said Mario Studio, but eh, it's okay. Yeah, but, that was my YouTube channel. Ah. Okay, so we got an email, so let's see what this... <clears throat> Mario, I now know where I'm being held. I'm on the moon. Yes, the moon that floats out in space. And I've learned something even more horrifying. In order to resurrect the monster's spirit, they need my... Need your what? Buy Cracker Fest cookies. The moon. The princess is on the moon, old boy. Smashing. But but why would her emo be cut off? Hmm. Wait just a tick. You don't suppose something happened to the poor girl, do you? I'm sure something has. Hello, Luigi. How's it going? And, uh, what the heck are you, buddy? I'm screaming. I wonder why view just plotted for us by the who holds the compass. Or I must deliver something. Hmm. Well, we're gonna learn about, uh, Luigi's adventures later. But anyway, folks, it's time to move on, and we're gonna find out where the final Crystal Star will be at. But Tell me it's, uh, Fre Mega Freak 400. <laughs> We'll see. Whoa. Hammer bro, that was a new enemy. I should have attacked him. Eh. I like how you say like like definitely in a high voice. Like oh. how you say like how you say like Mario's voice. Yeah. It's pretty good. I've been practicing. I oh yeah, this little sign here, uh, right next to the big pipe here in the pit of hundred trials. To show you what you got here. Uh, Deepest Little Reach, Record Power Bounces, which I have yet to do. Star Pieces found. There are 100 Star Pieces, and we have currently found 44 at the moment. I will be showing off the extra videos on trying to attempt on collecting every single Star Piece in the game. I am still attempting on doing that. But first, it's time for our 6th Crystal Star up. Now, folks, we are only 1 Crystal Star away. But this might be by far the most challenging one to get to. Or is it? Huh. I guess we'll find out. Alright, down, down to your door map. Reveal to us the final... I wonder what's gonna do. Let's reveal the final Crystal Star location. Where is it at? I think we already know what it's gonna be at, and... Uh-huh. No. Okay, guys. Okay, okay, guys. So, since you haven't met me, um, I'm the Mario Studio, as always. I'm a great Let's Player because I am doing uh, Super Mario Galaxy 2 and my Donkey Kong Country Returns. Those are the two Let's Plays that I'm doing right now. So you can go check my channel out because I'm a great Let's Player. And also, I made uh my singing series, so you can check out my singing series. So please don't like uh. Put negative comments because um a lot of people have put negative comments to my video so i only blocked like six people so like i was like oh my god i can't stand these people who put negative comments but the good thing is no one would put a rating anymore okay all right so you guys got that from mario studios so anyway yes now uh the last crystal star is gonna be on the moon so let's hear what uh frankly has to say if what this map indicates is true, the location of the Final Crystal Star is... The Moon. The Moon? Great gobbly! Princess Peach is there as well. This seems a bit... off. Yeah, it does. Hmm. This is a problem. It's how does one get to the Moon. Quite a con con conundrum. Give me a moment to look into this. Excuse me, please. This shouldn't take too long. Okay... Alright. 
Look into this may take a little time. So come back in a little bit, all right? Okay, so frankly, he's going to be busy for a little bit. All right, so we found a scrap paper smork. Oh, that's it. Okay. So I think we're going to do, uh, do a... Oh, we got mail. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I was just closing my door. Uh, it's okay. I barely even heard it. <laughs> okay, so now you've been, you've been seeing this big treasure chest here for episode one. So now we can finally get it with the Ultra Boots, and now we get the Ultra Hammer. So now we oh, are all that done. That weapon is so cool. It's just exactly like Super Mario. Ah, excuse me. Super Mario RPG: The Legend of Seven Stars, when Mario has to use the hammer. Right. So now we're gonna practice. Pretty much, it works just like the Super Hammer, just a little more powerful. So let's show our skills here. There we go. All right, no Wait, problem. Who's doing uh Super Mario, uh, Super Mario RPG for this for the Let's Play? Uh, I haven't done it yet, but I'm thinking about doing it soon. Oh, okay. So now we can break these gray light blocks here now with the Ultra Hammer in. Oh, told that it's okay. We'll still see you around. Is he hurt? What? Is he hurt? Oh no no, she's just she's uh she helps us with uh, the new moves we uh, get like the the super boots, the ultra boots, super hammer, ultra hammer. She just talks about how they work and since we got the last thing we needed, uh, she was gonna miss us. But no, okay, she's not. Guys, so... Hold on, what was I gonna say? Ah, my singing series. The one thing I like about my singing series because one of my favorite shows on Cartoon Network. It's called Total Drama World Tour. Those oh, are the yeah. same series that I'm doing right now. And right. my other scene series. That's but the good. last uh my scene series, I was doing I was seeing uh, Love and Time. Um when they land in uh Egypt. And then Duncan got disqualified because he was quit and Chris wants him to sing. <laughs> I remember that. You know Total Drama World Tour? Yeah, I watched um, I watched Total Drama, I Total Drama Island, Total Drama, um, Action, and then World Tour. I saw all three seasons. Okay, so he just. You know, what, you know what's my favorite character? Hmm. My favorite character, of course, is Owen. Yeah, I was about ready to say that Owen's pretty much my uh, favorite fan. And. Okay. And one of my favorite names, of course, is Noah, because um, that is totally an interesting name. Yeah, it is. Okay, so while uh, Mario Studio was chatting about the uh, Total Drama series, we go on ahead and Ultra Ranked Vivian Coops for uh, a certain reason, and decided to go ahead and get Miss Moe's an upgrade as well. So we got. Uh, we got a couple more to go to Ultra Rank. We need Gumbella, Flurry, and my little Gloomy, my little Yoshi. All right. So now, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, let's go back here real quick behind the house again, where we had to do for uh, to get prepared for Chapter Three. Now that we have our little Yoshi here, we can go ahead and get this. Let me get here and. Uh, oh! Okay, let's try not to ride in the water, Yoshi. Okay, once more. With feeling. There you go. And look at that. There's Shine Sprite. And. Okay. And we have another boat panel as well, so. That means we got another hidden. Uh, another item we need to collect. Yep, right That's here. That's cool. Yep, we found our treasure chest. So, what does this thing have? We got... Ah, double dip! This is a very good item. You can use uh, two items in battle. I think I know who I hate in Total Drama. Who? Ezekiel, because he's homeschooled. Ezekiel, Ezekiel. Oh, yeah. The one who wears a hat? Yeah, he's, uh... Yeah, I, I do feel sorry for the guy, but, you know, I, I just don't know anymore. I, I don't know. And then, 
and then like he turns into an animal. I'm not gonna lie, because I think it was made in like Africa, in Tanzania. I know that for sure. They kind of ripped off at the end of the last episode. They kind of ripped off Lord of the Rings right there. I think, I think, I think he like changed his face in the episode called I See London when Noah disqualifies. Yeah. Because I don't know why, uh, I mean, I couldn't remember how Noah disqualified. Hmm. All right, guys, so we'll be right back. I need to check out my badges real quick here. So I know you guys want to wait here this long, so I'll be right back. Uh, what the hell? Okay, it doesn't want to stop. I guess it'll stop as soon as it wants to. <laughs> okay, badges, badges, badges. Let's see. Yeah, I'm missing that one. Okay. Yep, I'll buy this off of you. Thank you. Uh, this thing will not get off. And have you ever seen in the... Have you ever seen the second episode when Ezekiel talks about girls and Kate, Sadie, Noah, Harold, and Cody were shocked at him? Yeah. Alright guys, we just got done with the badges here now. Uh, let's see. I want to make sure there may not be anything else I am missing. Oh, my hammer. Damn it. Hammer man, that's why I missed. Crap. Uh, Mega Rush, okay, did not get that. Ugh, okay. Uh, okay, I think we got everything else set. Oh, wait. What about that hammer? Nope, got all the hammers. Okay. Okay, false alarm, guys. We're good now. Alright, so, let me chat with you. Do you got anything good for me? Uh, oh, yes, you do. You got two badges I need in. Oh, yes, we, he has the W emblem. That is the Wario emblem. But, fortunately, we don't have enough coins for that one. So it's like 360. Outrageous. Um, yes, I got enough for an Ultra Shroom, too. Awesome. Yeah, I'll buy it off you. Thank you. Keep that W of them, though. I still want it. Alright, moving on. Also, I want to show you guys. Um, a lot of Mexican people do that in my school. But, check this out. Can you hear that? I sort of heard it. Hold on, let me try this again. I think that was clear. Yeah, I think so. A lot of Mexican people have done the whistle, and then the teachers tell them to stop. I don't know, I'd rather not even uh, talk about that. <laughs> Okay, omelet meal. I don't really want that. Uh, power. And I almost got straight A's. Oh, that's good. Okay. Uh. So. Oh, yes. Wait. Oh, wait. I've had no now. Okay, one moment, guys. Okay, I think frankly he's done reading, so I think we're ready to talk to him now. Ah, excellent timing. I finally have it, Mario. I found a way that might just get you to the moon. You must go to the Fall Outpost, and you must use the cannon there, and it will blast you. Oh. <clears throat> Whoa. I think math is... Okay. Oh, okay, I sorry. Think math is one of my favorite subjects in my high school. Well, that's good. Uh, hang on a sec. Wow, you're, we're using a cannon to blast ourselves to the moon? Yeah, extreme! I know how it sounds, really. To be honest, I'm not entirely sure of all the details. I count some far up health speak of a device that can launch anything, anywhere, even to the moon. Oh, interesting. This is gonna be so cool! Just point the way! Where is the f this far up house? I believe there's a pipe to far up house somewhere beneath Rogueport. I'm not sure yet of the exact location. Yes, I believe it was hidden for some reason. The information is correct, you need something called an Ultra Hammer to get it. Uh, we already got that. An Ultra Hammer? Hey, right on, we already got one of those! Ah, well, I see! That suddenly changes the subject now, doesn't it? Well, use the ult that Ultra Hammer to find the pipe to fall on pulse, then get to it! Yeah, you got it, pro uh, prof pr uh, Professor! Fire Pulse, charge! 
Oh, yes. One more thing. You should be aware of the bob who live there. There are sort of a surly bunch. They might not let you use their cannon. You may have to negotiate with them. Alright. In any case, that's your problem. Good luck. Get that last person started. You got it, Professor. I'll tell you what, guys, what was the problem in my math class. Okay, so, every week, uh, we always get an assessment, and I don't understand why. Alright. Maybe you should do, like, every month or something, but I'm not so sure about it. <laughs> I wouldn't know, to be honest. Uh, it's so weird that we always get assessment every week. I don't know why. Huh. Okay, so have you guys ever seen this block before when we head into Twilight Town? Now with the Ultra Hammer. Piece of cake. Yeah, we got a blue brick-like pipe here. And so, folks, dust begins. Uh, somebody call the curtain, please. Uh, thank you very much. Dust begins. Chapter 7. Mario so shoots the moon. So... Wait, what is Chapter 7 called? Uh, Mario Shoots the Moon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I heard you say moon. Yeah. Is, is this, is this, can't talk to you. It's still a bit cold out here. Come on, get down, let's move. Far up should be just up ahead, I think. <sighs> yeah, speaking of which, it's getting pretty chilly around here anyway. Okay, I'm gonna bring out Coop's. Oh yeah, let me show off uh, Coop's new move here. Uh. Oh, nuts! I was thinking of uh. <laughs> I'm thinking of uh Paper Mar uh, Paper Mario, the original Paper Mario, thinking of Cooper with the fire shell. Whoopsie! Fail on my the, part. You mean for the 64? Yeah, I was thinking of that. I slipped, but doesn't really matter. Um, got a little. Oh. Hello, there we got a new enemy. I might get this for my Wii, but right now what I'm getting is Majora's Mask. Oh, cool. And then Ocarina of Time, which is one of my favorite games. Good times. And we're styling and profiling, as always. Okay. So, one thing I don't like about Ocarina and Majora's Mask is those stupid plants that usually fly and has spikes. That was gonna scare me. <laughs> I can't blame ya. Okay, so these are new enemies we're up against. These are Ice Puffs. A little more health, and if I got the timing on that better, I would have been able to get a hit. Right, Bobbery. Appeal. And yeah, these guys can do a pretty good amount of damage. And when they charge up their attack... They can uh, possibly use a little blizzard attack to freeze you. I guess you would kind of call it your blizzard attack, maybe a, an icy wind. Pretty simple enough. Okay, I think we got a. Aha! Gotcha! I want to show this next battle too because I want to show off the new crystal star power. I don't think we show off uh, two of them really. We will show off Sweet Beast later. But we're going to show the showstopper. Our newest crystal star, so watch and learn. So just press the buttons here. Keep the combo going. And you get an excellent at the end of it. Wonderful. I think I remember, I think I remember the, the battle ah. music since I was a kid. Yeah. I don't know how old was I, because right now I'm a teenager. Ah. Okay, apparently I did get, not get an excellent on that. That was only a wonderful. Okay, dizzy dial. Sure, I'll take that. And pound star piece. Yay, new enemy. Who are you? Oh, you look like Frost Piranhas. There we go. Okay, let's actually show off Showstopper one more time. Oh, wow, these guys got 10 HP. Pretty powerful. All right. Let's try that again. This is pretty easy, really. I just don't know why I messed up. Okay. All right, wonderful. And now... There we go. There's excellent. Do your stuff. Uh, I'll tell you what, guys. 
I know how to speak three languages. They are French, Spanish, not Spanish, um, German, <laughs> and Japanese, aka France, Germany, and Japan. So the two things that I really know what it is, and the one thing I don't know about it. So let's go with uh, Germany. So speak this is called. So you can speak German. That's pretty Ubeth interesting. What do you say? I was saying it's pretty interesting. You can speak German. Okay, this is what I say when Kevin Seven Zero on Seven says, "Can I shoot the best? Siame will just siate there." That means you mess with the best, you die like the rest. Not the second of all, Japanese. And his goal is Jota Zol. That means enemy player defeated. And number three, French, laissez compétent, which I have no idea what that means, but I <laughs> saw the movie Home Alone. Ah, so I guess it. Home Alone's my favorite movie. Alright. See you later, Ice Puff. Alright. Uh, whoop. <laughs> Phone's ringing. I'll go check in a minute. Okay. Uh, yeah, Frost Piranhas can do a good amount of damage. They can also, there's a chance they can freeze you too, so be careful against those. Still styling and profiling, as always. Yeah. See you later, Frosty. Aw. Oh. Hey. Dummy with a boat. Not go. Uh oh. Sorry about that. It's okay. Okay, so there's ice puff's ability. You know what? We're gonna show it off. We're gonna let this ice puff show off its attack, and hopefully, I won't give, I won't freeze to death. So let's. All right, ice puff, do your stuff. Oh. So yeah, one extra damage. So not bad. All right. So that's in the end for the ice puff. And folks, we'll be right back.